Hello everyone, my name is Loco and welcome back to Locopia. Today, we're gonna continue building our city. Now, as always, I will be playing for about an hour, but I'm gonna be editing out all of the boring parts so you don't have to watch and, you know, or just have to basically sit down and watch me build all of these boring things. Because, you know, a lot of the time <laughs> is basically spent on just building and laying out the foundation and whatnot. So in the last episode, we built this little thing right here, the Locopian Tunnels. Uh, the fun little aspect of it obviously being that it's literally not connected anywhere. You know, well, it's obviously under connected underground, but you can't actually you can't actually see any of the things. And it actually works out really, really well. I'm actually really, really happy with that. Um, now, there's a couple things we can do in this, in this video. <clears throat> uh, first option is to actually have a look at this area right here, uh, which apparently is completely mined out. That's the idea. Someone in the comment section has actually pointed out that um, I, I set this one to be an ore mining business, but apparently ores actually mine out. I didn't know that. Um, so yeah, we may just have to um, basically change the type of the things uh, and actually like the type of the zone that it is and just remove the actual ore industry. All right, so I changed the district type right here of the Lacopian mining operation to just normal regular industry. I removed all of the buildings and whatnot as well um, that should basically... That should basically make this zone work again. Now, this still looks awful, though, so I'm just gonna leave it as it is right now. Uh, see how it turns out and see if it will actually, you know, grow into something that looks a little bit nicer. But I think the main focus of this episode is gonna be trains. I really want to try and figure out a way to make trains work in this city as well. And I don't know exactly if I want them running alongside the, the roads or if I want to start them just somewhere completely else. Now, the obvious issue that we got going on when it comes to trains is that I don't know where to put them. I mean, I don't have very much room here at all to make trains happen at all. Now, I'm thinking of maybe just, at the very least, like, moving a lot of this stuff over here. We're just gonna turn this one off and actually empty it as well. Uh, but, like, moving maybe the, the top half or, like, the, well, I guess from this angle, the top half of this and just start my training operation over there. Now, obviously, we do want to try and make it as... You know, as good looking as we possibly can. Um, so yeah, I guess we better just get started. Alright, so I've literally not done this before yet. I wanted to start over there, but since we have a cemetery that's emptying right now, we'll instead start over here and connect it to, um, together later. Um, but let's see what we can do. So we basically have two different ones. We got a cargo train terminal, uh, which is something that we may need, and we also have a train station. Now both of them would be quite useful, and I think we want to have them relatively close together. Uh, so we can connect them to the uh, rest of the city as well. I'm thinking of just well putting down the um, the train station right here and see uh, see if we can make it look reasonable. Okay, so we got some humble beginnings right here. Now I want to try and make this one look kind of organic um, and like an actual real train, or at least that's the goal. Uh, so I'm gonna try and make these kind of exits that are at every single train station. Obviously, I want to have a loop around right here as well for the people that don't actually need to be at this train station right here. So with a little bit of trouble right here, I managed to actually get this one sort of like dug out into the mountain. That's what I'm trying to go for right here. I'm I'm actually thinking about like making it loop around here and maybe like maybe connect over here somewhere. We actually can finally move this thing around, this cemetery. Uh, where do you guys want the cemetery now? Uh, but I'm thinking of like making it connect somewhere over there instead of like where we had originally uh, had it planned. We'll just move this thing over there for now. And we can finally remove this road as well. There we go. So I think I'm just gonna try and keep making it like cut into the mountain right here. It's a bit of a hassle though, because you don't really know exactly like when it will. For example, right here, you know, it will, but sometimes it just randomly decides to do this instead, which is not really what we're looking for. I think I just managed to make it work right there. <laughs> it's actually really cool though. I actually really, really like that. Uh, we have to find a better solution for these motorways like going on you know, either end right there at some point, but this is really nice. Um, I'm thinking of making it connect in, well, maybe somewhere over there. And can we actually go, is it possible to go through the mountain? Ooh, we do, I do know that you can make tunnels with these things as well. We'll see. If we could make a tunnel, oh, that would be so awesome. But I'm thinking of making um, like a second train station or, or like a, a second train station somewhere over here. That seems like a good spot. What? That just worked. I don't even know how expensive this was. I just randomly clicked a bunch of times and it just connected to the other side of the mountain. I really don't even want this one. But apparently it's possible, that's pretty insane. Uh, train, where'd you go? 
No idea where Mr. Train went. Um, I just... Hey, there it is. <laughs> can we connect? Or can we, can we like, delete this? Woo! Okay. So it is possible to make one go all the way through the mountain. Um, that actually opens up a bunch of different options. We can have a train basically go through the mountains over there as well. That'd be so cool. Alright, so I removed a couple of the dirt roads over here. And I'm going to be adding on my second train station over here somewhere as well. Uh, I want to have it... Right there seems good. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. And now we can actually make like a curve right here into the mountain. That'd be really, really cool. But first off, we need to connect those two um, together, obviously. This seemed a lot easier than I actually expected it to be. I mean... It doesn't sound like a big deal to go through the mountain right here, but for some reason it either keeps like digging under or going over. I mean, I've been I've been trying to do this for a very long time right now. And I'm not really I'm not really getting much progress. Either I'm getting like these bridges, uh, these bridge sort of things, but don't look bad either. But I mean, it wasn't the original plan. <laughs> so I've been trying different ways to make this work, but there's no magical way. I'm afraid we may have to like just try something else. We could even just go all the way on the ground and, you know. Alright, I got a new plan. Instead, I'm going like the, the easy way around and this is this this is actually painful because this took forever. Like this took way too long. It shouldn't have taken this long, but looks like we have a, a hole into... Or actually, no. It's just like a, a gap in the mountain, apparently. Apparently, we created a gap in the mountain, but right now we're just gonna try and connect it the easier route instead because, you know, I was trying out different things and it seemed to work out alright, but... It would just look really funny after it, uh, after it, you know, finished. So see if we can make it work like this instead. Why is it so difficult to connect those couple things? I seriously don't know. Like, it seems like it's really easy, but for some reason, they just, like, refuse. They do not want to, like... They do not want to, like, go anywhere. It says slope too steep, but then for some reason I can, like, go literally inside of the mountain. Which is interesting. I think I may just end up using a little, little like, overhead thing like that. Just because I, I don't want to be doing this for any longer. I've been literally doing these little train rails right there for about 30 minutes. That's not even a joke. Oh my god. That, that, yeah, right. Maybe one day I will, I will be brave enough to try and go back and um, finish what I started. But as of right now... I'm thinking this is gonna be what we're going for. I mean... Oh, come on. Alright, let me try and demonstrate this, okay? You would say this is not an issue, right? I can build, like, little tiny bits right here. And then all of a sudden... It just randomly says that the slope is too steep. Oh, what? What? Oh! Oh, I got a magic little bit right there. I'm just gonna keep clicking. Maybe I'll find the magic bit. Wait, I saw a little bit of... I saw blue. How hard can it be to connect those two things together? You would imagine that, right? You would imagine that that is a really easy process. And it's not even my first choice. I guess we, we would like to have to like... Make it a bridge or something. Like make it go all the way up. Something silly like that. For some reason, it seems to be utterly impossible to connect those two things together. I'm not even kidding. Like, I, I have no clue how hard this could have possibly been. I mean, I would have just positioned this thing somewhere else, but right now I'm committed. I'm, I'm gonna do this. I'm literally gonna spend the entire episode trying to connect two little lines right there together. That seem very easy. I mean, we can use a tunnel, but tunnels, no. I don't, I don't want to use a tunnel here. The first bit is fine, and then all of a sudden right here it decides that it doesn't want to build here. Oh, we found something. I'm scared to move my mouse right now, but I want to... Okay, okay, please keep working. Please click... No! Don't turn red again. There's nothing special here. You can just like go to the ground. That's fine. That's fine. And then it randomly like doesn't go anywhere anymore. At least not to the left. Or not to the right rather. To the left is fine apparently for some reason. This is going to be the most creative railway system in the world. Loco rails. Creative as hell. Random ass loop. Should I try and like redo this? Or are we just gonna leave this as a memory to how awful this thing was to put down? <laughs> what is this? What is this? Okay, it works. I'm not, I'm not even gonna do anything. I'm not even gonna touch it anymore.
Okay, time to change this thing up a little bit. Make it look a little bit better, I suppose. Alright, so that'll do. So basically what we did is connect this little bit of train station. Connect it over to this train station. That is literally what I've been spending... Hold on, let me check. The last 40 minutes and 56 seconds on. That is that is an impressive amount of time for an ugly <laughs> an ugly looking train station. But I'm thinking this is just gonna stay just as a memorial. We may even like hold on. We may even make a district right here. Remove this. We we have no use for what is going on here. Because this is gonna be its own separate little district. And we'll call this The Train Rails of Doom. Train Rails of Doom. Okay. I don't even know if that's one word or two words, but I honestly don't care right now. Train Rails or Train and Rails. Okay. Now the next step is to actually try and get this Train Rails through the mountain. Far over the misty... No, the, the big ass mountains. Goes a train rail towards Lokopian Square. We must connect. <laughs> this is never gonna work, is it? <laughs> this is an awful idea, Loco. Don't trust your luck. Okay, so I got one side into the mountain, I suppose. Now it's just a matter of finding something that would actually work. Hold on, we can just use a straight one here, I suppose. We need to connect it in here somewhere. Can we make it any lower? Can we just like slowly move it onwards? Is that an option? <gasps> I got one! I got one! Where is it? I don't see it, but it's here! Train rails! Oh, you're underground, obviously. You need to come up here. Yeah, here you go. There you go. Come up now. Come on now. Come on, boy. <laughs> come on. No, 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 no. Where are you now? There you are. Okay. Imagine living in those flats. There's literally a train rail under your house. You're not even aware of it. <gasps> there we go. Okay. Okay. Sorry, excuse me. I know you're there's people living here, but I guess I'm gonna have to move this high school to the other side of the road. Destroy some more houses in the process, but it's all fine, guys. Don't worry about it. We got this. Okay, so now we can finally grab this. Alright, nice. Nice. Can we now actually make this this like No 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 don't do that? I was- I would just wanted to like make it look a little bit better. There's people immediately moving in here. I'm sorry guys. This- this project wasn't happening if it wasn't for your house. There we go. Great. Great. Alright, maybe I should just like unzone this instead and like... Get in a um... Are you a house? Nope, you're just a residence. Ah, you're something that we can move. Here, go over there. Um, now we just need to add a train station to this end as well. If this would fit, I will turn out to be a very happy boy. Please. Okay, over here maybe? Steep. Oh my god. Height too high? S slope too steep. <gasps> Found a way to make this one work. We're gonna connect it over here. And then like follow the curve. Or at least, like, have it try to follow the curve of the uh, massive intersection that we got going on over here. And then, like, later on we can make this look a little bit prettier. Try making a bit of a slow, or, uh, like, a little bit of a, um, of a thing that moves over the road right there, but... Don't know if I like it too much. Can we just connect it like that? Does that work? Oh, that works. And we just have to connect it to the actual thing over here as well. We did it. We did it. This is all good. This is all good. Now we just have to fix this one this one wire that we uh, basically demolished. There we go. 
Oh, this is a, a tricky setup that I got going on right there, but cars can go through, trains can go over that as well. This should be really, really good. Okay, now it's just a matter of making this area look not as awful as it is right now. Oh, that's actually cool. If you use these pads right here, uh, which is like the, the gravel pads, they're actually pretty much the same color as the train. Like, uh, yeah. Wow, the sand actually sort of merges. That's cool. I didn't know that. Can do the same over here, I suppose. Like, add a couple of trees in this, like, little bit of dead space. Make it sort of, like, fade in a little bit better. At least with the terrain that we got going on over here. Same for this little, uh, little bit right there. Is that a house? Why is someone living here? Oh, because you guys are allowed to, apparently. Sorry about that. Now you're not allowed to anymore. Let me add some more trees. Your house has literally been removed because I wanted to put down more trees. Alright, so there we go. This one looks cool. I really like the look of this little area that we got going on over here. Um, yeah, so this one will go over here, all the way under the ground, through the mountain, towards the other side, come down over here, and over here we'll have to, like, I guess, prettify this, this little area over here as well. There's, like, one random mouse right here. I'm really sorry, guys, but you're gonna have to go as well, I'm afraid. Okay, and we'll do the same thing with the paths over here as well. Or at least, like, try and make it use- like, a little bit more useful. I don't even mind that. Like, that- that's- that's pretty cool. I like that. It's basically like coloring in a, uh, a train station, I suppose. At least have a bunch more sand lying around. There we go. Poof, more sand. Okay, well, we can, we can make that look even better at some later point. I think it is time for the final little bit, at least for now, for the... Well, what's it called again? The Train Rails of Doom. And that is going to be adding the actual tracks in here, or like the actual routes in here as well. So we got train lines. We want to have one line starting over here, going over there. Then you want to go through the mountain to the other side. And then... Do I have to like make it the other way around as well? And you go... Right there. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. So apparently it isn't taking another stop right there, but... Let's have a look. I want to see this thing go through the mountain. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on. Let me actually lower it down. So let's just follow the process all the way, okay? So we're waiting for a train to come out over here. Any train? About to approach here. Any second now. Do people not like this? Oh yeah, there we go. There's a train coming in. Okay, okay, here we go. So we'll slow it down a little bit. This guy is going all the- Oh, actually, let me slow it down. This guy is going down there, and actually, wow! Almost got a play- or a crash right there. Looks like we're good, though. Okay. These are pretty trains. I do give you that much. I mean, I'm paying- paying good taxes for it. They make the little loop around at the train rails of doom. Go towards the beach. Very, very cool. There we go. It's going to the beach. And then I want to see what actually happens when it goes underground. I have no idea what it looks like if you follow something like this. Oh god, it's speeding up! Right in front of the train stop. That seems like a risk, sir. You gotta really watch out. Oh, there's even people stepping in as well. Alright. So here goes nothing. Okay. Oh, oh. Is, is that where we had it? Oh, right, right. <laughs> Through that. Oh, and there we are <laughs> on the other side. Beautiful, beautiful. It does go quite fast, though. It doesn't give a shit about that truck right there. That truck had to stop. <laughs> very cool, very cool. And eventually, we'll get to the final stop for this train at the very least. Awesome. So once again, nice little bit of progress. If you haven't already, hit that like button. If you want to see more, hit that subscribe button as well. So you'll be the very first one to get a notification when I upload another video. And I want to thank you guys all for watching. Have an amazing day. Do not forget to smile. And I'll see you in the next one.